Do we really need to play this romantic music while we're in the shower? Uh, Benjamin, can you please change this tune? All right, survivors, welcome back to the Escapist. It is now the 11th day of Bondwood's captivity here in the lair of an evil villain. And we are making amazing progress. I think we're just about out of here. Day 11, and I think we might be able to shoot this rocket off pretty soon. All right, guys, let's just lie here in bed for a moment or two, work off some of that fatigue from our late night exploits last night. You can see that my heat is super high because we got into the henchman's barracks last night, but that didn't fool anybody. We were spotted instantly, but we made it to the mystery box. We got the key card out, and there it is. And we need the key card to activate the, uh, the rocket ship to get the heck out of here. That's one of the things we need. We need three special items in total, and I think the other one is a voice recorder of some type. And then the fingerprint, which we have underground right now. I don't see it here, so it must be down in our stash. So those three things. But before we try to fire off a rocket ship, we have a delivery to make. A lighter for Walton. Very important. Lives depend on it. People will die if we don't get this lighter to Walton ASAP Blondie. And have this dirt. Whatever. Right. Mum's the word, my friend. Let's get that rocket active. What do you think I'm working on, Prowler? Sheesh. All right. Here we go. Shakedowns. Blondie and Piers. All right. Hey, uh, Piers, if you have anything you want to get rid of, like that double wood rainbow across the sky. <laughs> I don't need your wood. Crane, how about you? Double rope all the way across the sky. I love it. Everybody's doubles today. Blondie, have some food. Can you be my lapdog? Of course you can. Prowler, how are we doing? You know what? You can have this fake decorated egg, and you are my biggest fan. I knew it all along. Can't take that job, my friend Walton. Oh, here's your lighter. I almost forgot. There you go. Save the world. <laughs> I love being a spy. And now we have to... Oh my gosh. Four beat-up jobs. Elbra for Chen and Prowler. Chen and Morn for Prowler. Prowler wants everybody beat up. All right. Well, I can do that. Maybe not. We might have to hit the, uh, hit the weights today. Get some strength. But first, let me grab some food. Can't fight in an empty stomach, you know. All right, so let's check Elber. Elber, how tough are you? 59 strength and 50 speed. My gosh, he's a beast. Hey, wait. Oh, he works in the kitchen. We can jump him in the kitchen. I think if I jump him, I might be able to take him. <laughs> or maybe I'll grab a little help from Prowler. The only problem is I have to deliver the kill and blow to get the job done. And I kind of just want to keep my, uh, my nose clean today. I'm not sure if I even want to do this, but let's just give it a try. Do I have a weapon? Shoe knife, it's a 3-5. Okay, yeah. Just let me deliver the kill and blow, okay, buddy? Otherwise, I won't get credit for the job. No, just stay with me. Stay with me. Actually, can you even hop over? Oh, the, can you hop over? Oh, my gosh. Someone saw me jumping over. Get in here. Yeah. Get him. Let me do the kill and blow. Stop. Stop. I got it now. I think I got it. All right. Now you can go. Get out of here. Stand down. Uh, what do we need here? I will take that plastic. He, he poked me with a plastic fork. And I'll take that lighter so we can make, um, so we can make some plastic. We're going to need it for a key mold. Thanks, Prowl. You're Prowler's frame. <laughs> That's the rumor on the street, buddy. <laughs> He's also not the sharpest tool in the shed, is what they say. Yeah, so today we want to get up into the uh, the villain's residence that's in the north end of this facility. Hi, Josh! Um, but I need the red key for that. So we have to try to take out... So we're going to take some guards out today and look for the red key. And I have no idea which guard has the red key. I haven't seen it yet. Oh my gosh, I'm so fatigued. Let's jump in the shower real quick. Whew! So what we'll do is we'll run back to our cell, grab a few of our weapons, and just start whacking guards randomly. All right, back at home base. Let's dump this stuff in here. And by the way, you cannot use a plastic fork to make the uh, molten plastic. I just realized that. So that is my mistake. So what we need is a comb. Uh, comb will work, and I need that. And ooh, I'll take that garroting watch too. I need all the weapons I can get. I'm knocking these guards out. So, let's go ahead and make the putty right now. And this is going to be just more contraband, unfortunately, but I'd rather just do it and get it done. And we can move some of the stuff underground if necessary. I'm going to bring the wad of putty and a bunch of weapons. Here we go. We've got uh, the flamethrower, Garrett, 
and a bum surprise. <laughs> uh, that ought to do. Let's get to roll call. And the shoe's only going to work one more time after this one. Oh, gosh. Prowler, get to roll call. I know about the rocket. You don't have to tell me every time I walk by. All right, here go, here come the uh, shakedowns, I hope. Okay, whew. How are we doing, Albert? I'm so sorry I beat you up. Pierre seems to be drawn to this. No, I can't do that. I don't beat people up. What do I look like to you, a goon? Anywho, all right, let's um, let's start targeting some of these guys here. Rodney have taken down Odell. We've checked his pockets. We've checked Benjamin. They don't have it. Shelby doesn't have it. So we've got to go after some of the guards that we don't that we haven't hit yet. Grab the guards' attention next morning. We'll call. Nah, I don't do that stuff anymore. Walton, how about you? Pretty sure henchman Joshua. Josh? Okay. Yeah, I haven't I haven't checked Josh's pockets yet, so we'll try that today. And oh man, Prowler, I really don't want to beat anybody else up right now. Um Prowler, we beat up Elbra. Why didn't you pay me for that? Dude! Where Oh, that's why he's not here. You got my back. You're a liar. <laughs> you owe me money. <laughs> 19 bucks. I took Elbert down. You were there the whole time. Wow. Anywho. All right. Let's take down some guards. We haven't taken down Boogie yet, but I like Boogie. And I don't want to go through contraband detectors right now. So Odell we smashed. Uh, Taylor. I don't think we've hit Taylor yet, have we? Taylor, Rodney, Coop. Hold on. Who do we have to go after? Oh, Josh. Let's at least hit Josh first, and then we'll grab some of these other guys. You gotta do it somewhere where no one's gonna see it, like in the shower. Oh, super cold. Oh, he was just in the shower all by himself. Gotcha. Oh my gosh, he's got it. Red key. Super cool. You're the coolest, buddy. Uh-oh. Somebody's coming. Somebody's coming. Get that back on. Quick, 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 quick. Run! Whew. Who's that? Oh, it's you. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna take that, too, if you don't mind. That's a 3-5. Uh, yeah. This will send him back. <laughs> Running home! So he won't come after me. Oh, look! <laughs> so his partner just picked it up. Well, I guess we got the red key. <laughs> Here he comes. Help! There's a naked bald man chasing me! <laughs> Super cold, what have I ever done to you? It's evening meal time. Come on, I've got to eat. A man needs his nutrition. Get out of here. Whew. All right. Well, that was good. That was fortuitous. And what do we have here, Walter? Nothing. I don't even really need anything anymore. All right, cool. So now we just go back, make the red key, and tonight we will um, get up into the uh, villain's little residence house, or whatever the heck it is up there. Orly! You deserve that, Prowler. You owe me $19. You know what? Forget it. There you go. You don't owe me anything anymore, okay? I have relieved your debt. I have released the lien. But I will take your glass shank and your tub of talcum. And I was going to take your clothes, but I don't have any room for it. <laughs> All right, let's get back right now. Oh. Oh, it's exercise period. Oh, no. <gasps> it's the villain. I look forward to exterminating you. I forgot that it was exercise period, and I'm late. Oh, man. All right, let's train. I was heading home to get rid of some of this stuff. And one of the guards politely reminded me that I was supposed to be exercising. <laughs> Do we really need to play this romantic music while we're in the shower? Uh, Benjamin, can you please change this tune? Call the boss. I don't like this music. It's giving me a strange tingle. Yeah, him too. See what I tell you? <laughs> I have rights, you know. Oh, okay, it's time. Let's head back. Now, I want to just make a quick swap here. Drop. Drop that. Drop that. Pick that up. That's a 4-5 weapon, so I'm going to give away the shoe knife and hang on to the glass shank. Hey, buddy! I have a shoe knife. Okay, now, let's make this key before I get too dumb to do it. It is the red key. Awesome, that. And now, let's just dump all this stuff back in here. I don't need it. And all of this contraband here is making me a little nervous. Let's go underground, and we'll do a bit of digging. 
and we can drop some of the stuff down there. Drop it. Sturdy shovel. Actually, you know what? Let's not dig. Let's just get rid of this stone right here. You know what I could do is I could make that multi-tool. But I'm not even sure if we need any digging or mining implements anymore. This thing's still at 55% sturdy. Man, that was tough. Do I... Oh, I have a memoir tape here. Okay, I, I, you know what? I'm going to get rid of this other memoir tape. I don't think I need more than one. I'm hoping. And my guess is the same with the putty. Oh, you know what we can try? Oh, I want to try something. I saw in the comments that the blue putty is used with the weak fingerprint. Let's try it. Weak fingerprint. And the blue putty. And oh my gosh, it works! Fake fingerprint! Awesome! So that, along with the voice recording and the key card, will be uh, used to escape, to, to activate the rocket. I think there's three things over there. Hey, uh, Crane? Have some memoir tapes. Let's go check real quick, right now. And then uh, then tonight, we'll, we'll see what we can do up in the residence. So this is the insert the launch key into the slot to activate. Right, so we have the launch key. Oh gosh, I forgot there's cameras in here. Only the soft, velvety tones of a loyal henchman will enable this. That's where the, the tapes come into play. And this is only... And only the fingerprint of the villain in charge can activate this. We have the villain's fingerprint from his dirty shot glass that we found. Awesome. All right, so um, all we need now is to find the tape recorder, uh, the, the voice recorder. And I think that's back there. So right now, there's really nothing else to do. Maybe go through a few desks over at home over here. Maybe find a new shoe or something. Fake shoe? I don't know. I have a lot of beat up jobs bar of chocolate all right let's just go through a couple of desks real quick here oh maybe we're not gonna go through desks real quick here um grab that all right well let's just get to roll call all right here we are let's get the names of the turkeys prowler and walton it's too bad i'm sorry to hear that prowler prowl i know that things have been rough between us, so have <laughs> a comb shiv, okay? It's a little better. Shen selling. I'd like some more duct tape, if possible. Anybody? Nobody. All right, this is it. We run back home, put our henchman uniform on, and then sneak up into the villain's lair. Oh, look who it is, Super Cole. You are not going to stand here all night. Ho, 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 ho. That's what they do. They know that I have rights. They can't just beat me up all the time, but they will stand outside your door so you can't sneak out the holes in your walls. It's uh, it's diabolical, I'll tell you. All right, let's put this in the oven. Turkey in the oven. And we got our henchman outfit on. Close them doors, please. And what else do we need? We don't need the key card. We need the red key, obviously. It's going to set off the alarm, but that's okay. And I... Don't ha Oh, you know what we can do? Let's bring a sharp tea tray with us. In case we need to knock somebody out. And a flamethrower. We'll just... It will, we'll keep the garret here. So we'll bring two weapons. Just in case someone gets a little too close. And... Oh, I can make a contraband pouch. Oh, hold up. You know what? Let's do that. We'll get rid of this foil. Let's just do that right now and make a really super duper one. Durable. Oh, awesome. And that frees up a ton of space. And we'll, uh, we'll futz around with that later. But I do want to put this in the first slot. All right. No guards? Let's roll. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, sorry, Cheryl. I missed. I don't usually miss, miss with my Cheryl. And here we go. Hey, buggy. I'm the new guy. That's right. First day on the job. All right, guys. This is it. On three, two, one, go. I don't know if they're going to recognize us in here or not. I don't want to take any chances. Wow, he's got the whole world map here. What is that? It's like an explosion. Is that a, a nuclear mushroom cloud? You got some activate. Oh, 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 oh. Mystery box. Tape player. Wow, we got it. Hey, that was easy. <laughs> 
Uh, awesome! So now all we have to do is go play our tapes, our memoirs. We've already been over there. That's the evil villain's uh, office. Oh boy, who's this? Rodney. Rodney. Alright, is that it? That's the only thing that's up here? This isn't a residence anyway. This is like his um, meeting room. Yeah, this is like the planning room. Oh! Oh! Oh, we could have we could have gone in through the vents, but no, we're done. Wow, all that work for a red key just for this little tape player. Pay is awful. Nah, I don't bowl. All right, so well, let's, let's just get back. It's three o'clock in the morning. Let's make our little tapey thing. And make sure I have space to pick up Cheryl. Put her down. And now, my friend, we get the memoir tapes. And let's put it together and see what happens. Memoir tape. Tape player. <gasps> Voice recording. Wow. We could just go right now. Three o'clock in the morning. What do you say? I don't know if we can do this at night. Um, I'm going to wait till the morning. Let's just do it tomorrow. I'm, I'm tired. And I, I don't want to fly a rocket um, when I'm fatigued. Because I might fall asleep at the uh, the controls, you know what I'm saying? Let's just do it tomorrow. We'll have another episode. <laughs> so let's take off the tux. I mean, the uh, henchman outfit. Put the tux back on. Climb into bed. And we'll see you guys in the next episode. Because I think we're ready to fly out of here. Alright, we'll see you in the morning. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Scratch that idea. I'm out of here right now. I'm pretty sure this is all we need, guys. The voice recording, the fake fingerprint, and the key card. Let's go. And I thought about maybe making another episode and then trying these, um, trying to activate the panel, but it doesn't make any sense to have a whole episode of that's all it takes. So let's try it right now. This is the uh, key card panel. If it doesn't work, we're going to be in trouble. <laughs> voice recording. And the fake fingerprint here. Oh, oh wow! Oh, that's it! Oh, that was kind of anticlimactic. I'm sorry. <laughs> you escaped. Duct tapes are forever. The evil villain's lair, whoever the heck he was, is now behind us. And I, I didn't give away any parting gifts. But uh, I'm glad I tried that right now rather than start up a whole new episode. Because seriously, that's all it was. What, 30 seconds worth? Anywho, so... How do we do? We did okay, I guess. 7378. 7378 seems like a pretty good score. I don't know. Anyway, now we're going to rub it in the faces of Elfwood and Punchwood because 11 days or 12 days is pretty darn good. Oh, that's excellent. And there's a little happy face down here. Oh, I clicked it. Oh, darn. I didn't mean to do that. Anyway, I think uh, clicking anywhere in that screen brings you back to the beginning. Well, isn't that nice? Now Bondwood is going to have something to talk about at the family gatherings like for thanksgiving dinner right so now that he has escaped a uh, a prison all of the boys elfwood pablo and bondwood have um have all escaped something so they're all kind of on equal footing although punchwood has escaped way more than the other two anyway so that's it for now guys i hope you enjoyed maybe we'll do that escape team dlc that we just saw there moments ago i don't know i'll think about it um, there's a lot of other games I want to play right now, so I might put this on hold for a bit. But uh, let me know in the comments what you think. If you want to see more Escapist, then I will uh, put it on the to-do list anyway. All right, that's it for now. Hope you all enjoyed. This is Bondwood signing off, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.